I feel lumpy, dumpy, frumpy, and grumpy. It's now a bad time to tell you I'll probably be doing a fundraiser all throughout December for Thor News Year 11. Also, since this is late night bad mood me, I think it's really weird that they canceled Houston Independent School District campuses across the board and facilities on Tuesday for water boil shit that happened on Sunday. Just saying it, man. All right. The energy was super heavy the second half of yesterday, which was uh, Monday. Did you feel it? Anyway, and well, we do have the giant mega storm coming in later today. Today is now Tuesday. Here we're looking at another fireball. It's been like super fireball season. Here was a very bright fireball illuminated the night sky over southern Brazil yesterday. So, yeah, dude, we've been getting a lot of fireballs. I don't know if you heard volcano activities up. Hey, Grimes had a song called We Appreciate Power. It's four year anniversary. And she's got a cute butt. All right, that's me unfiltered and unhinged. Now that free speech is allowed on planet Earth, I said that totally tongue in cheek. Did you hear Elon started a, ba a battle with Tim Cook and Apple? Which is very interesting. Oh, here we're looking at a giant mega massive filament where sometimes the sun sends energy to other stars and maybe celestial bodies out there in outer space in the heavens. Who knows? Everything's crazy. It's weird how, like, the older I get, the less I seem to know and understand. But I do know this is one heck of a filament. This image and graphic brought to us by George Alvarez. Thank you, George. Elon Musk is going to put Apple out of business, said Matt Wallace. And then Slate was like, why? Did he buy it? What I think is weird is remember when Elon told everyone to buy Bitcoin was it, when it was like 40 or 50,000? And then Elon told everyone to buy Dogecoin when it was like 50 cents and 60 cents? And then they both crashed and all the people who took his advice are like, yeah, he's the smartest dude ever. Anywho, he's definitely good at business. Oh, hey, at least a 30% chance these dragon eggs are going to hatch over Jackson, Mississippi. Um, it looks increasingly more and more volatile. And this area, the danger area, has shifted to south now. But let's hope tomorrow's storms disappoint, but I don't, I'm not sure they're going to. All right, so just letting y'all know, maybe I'm feeling this energy. Because I'm over here and it's just passing over me now. And yeah, dude, it feels bad. Yeah, November 2022 was definitely not my favorite month of the year. It wasn't horrible for me, but I just, I don't know. It was an all crappy off month. Anywho. Everybody always fighting about something. And in crypto news, the exchange Bitfront has shut down. How about a little math for you in the Apple and um, Elon Musk situation? So Apple pulling its revenue from Twitter is like 50 million a year in revenue, which is 6,250,000 blue check marks at $8 a piece. Anywho, apparently if you pull your advertising, that's free. That's not free speech. I don't know. But also the guy who's like, yeah, dude, Tesla's totally going to crush Apple. Well... Over the last year, Tesla stock is down 51%. Apple stock is only down 10%. Yeah, I don't know. Elon buying Twitter has not really been super great luck for him so far. But, you know, it is interesting to watch all the people who are like, yeah, dude, it was so awesome that he wore an upside down cross goat head Baphomet suit of armor for Halloween. Um. Okay, and he hasn't mentioned China in any way, shape, or form since July. I learned that fact from Linda Alden. She kind of looks like an elf. I mean that in the most complimenty kind of way. Brooks Gardner letting us know, to quote Game of Thrones, winter is coming, and so the Arctic freeze is eventually on the way for the probably the second half of December. So, okay. 
there we go. Well, we are getting, you know, tornadoes tomorrow, probably. And tornadoes in November are pretty dang rare. All right, everybody stay cool. Or whatever, you do you. Mars retrograde's always weird. God bless everyone.